Meteorologist Bill Ray joining us right now. Ah, I thought we were done seeing the word tropical. Well, you know, the tropical season is not over. We've hit the peak in September, a secondary peak in mid-October. And I wanted to show you this today and remind you that yesterday was the uh, 54th anniversary. It was 1956. No, the 66th anniversary of Hurricane Hazel that smashed into the South North Carolina beaches as a Category 4 storm, one of the biggest storms on record. So you can get these kind of storms in October. But right now, things not too shabby out there. We had a little area of showers and storms that aren't going to develop that the Hurricane Center thought might develop earlier. But there are two areas they're watching. Basically, this little area of showers and storms, 30% chance of development as it drifts to the southwest and looking for something to develop here. Nothing has now, but maybe in five days, a little a coagulation of showers and storms could develop into something down well in the southwestern uh, Caribbean Sea. So nothing to concern North Carolina or us, but uh, just kind of bringing that up and reminding you it is still hurricane season and Hazel came ashore, boom, right there in the Brunswick County beaches back in 19. 56. Temperatures in the mid 70s for the ocean water temperatures this weekend. So let's get you to the beach. <laughs> Why not? It's going to be cooler, warmer in the water than it is out on the land. 65 on Saturday, 73 on Sunday. Oh, peak time for the leaves in the mountains. At this, it continues to lower the elevations down along the Blue Ridge. You should see great color. Sunny in 59 tomorrow. Sunny and cool 60. Lows will be in the 30s. All right. For us, though, today we got to get through the rain before we can have that sunny forecast. We've got 68 right now in Raleigh, 67 Smithfield, 66 Goldsboro, 69 Fayetteville, and about as warm as we'll be uh, coming up here at 6 o'clock. Temperatures will actually struggle to move anywhere but downward slowly but surely today. So it's warmer now than it'll be at 5 o'clock this afternoon by about 8 degrees or so. So make note of that. The highs are occurring as we speak this morning as a cold front will come through the winds will shift to the north so we've got rain showers you see a couple blobs moving up through sanford or siler city in sanford and then move through the triangle it's light rain right now in the triangle but the moderate rain showers up by near lewisburg and north of oxford and henderson at this time so here comes the front you can see it moving through some rain showers through noon and then we get a little break and then there'll be one little gasp of maybe squeezing out that moisture with that cool air moving in during the evening hours and then we turn sunny for the weekend. So these high temperatures are morning temperatures mid to upper 60s in the sand hills near 70 upper 60s along the coastal plain and midish 60s to lower 60s as we look from the triangle toward the virginia border so the high temperature today probably occurred at midnight <laughs> it's not going to occur this afternoon 64 ish uh, this morning and then falling into the upper 50s late in the day 43 tonight 63 on saturday 67 on sunday there's your sunny weekend for us mostly sunny monday then we get mild if you like it mild you got upper 70s by next wednesday partly cloudy skies and pulling out the complete exclusive 10-day forecast maybe a few showers with a front either friday or into saturday next week and then back into the upper 60s on sunday so a chill coming this weekend but sun will be great